Hello, I'm Brandon Olin, and I'm back with a new season of Impact with our new superintendent, Dr. Cheryl Dyson. She is so excited to get to know more about our students and connect with them in this unique and special way. We are off to a great start this 2022-2023 school year. You know, and our students amaze me every day. On today's episode, we got a chance to visit West Frederick Middle to surprise an eighth grade student named Austin Cheek. Let's find out more about him. It's important to me as an educator to have a sense of community. Um, Austin was new here and he saw that one of our newer students was having um, a tough time adjusting to being new here. And he came to the emotional well-being you know, of this student, came to me and said, this client, I think this student needs some help. So there was this new student in my career engineering class, me and him actually helped that new student out, getting him ready for the class for pre-engineering. We set up his computer. He was so welcoming to everybody in our in our crew. Um, he really em embraced, you know, the, the younger kids. Um, we have uh, a mix of sixth, seventh, and eighth graders, and. Um, he has befriended all of them. Austin's like a really caring person. Um, if you need help, he's always there for you. Austin, even when like, I first met him, I knew he was like a good person on the first day of school. And I think that he helped people because he like, that's just something like to do because he's a good person. He's really popular with all the kids and he also helps kids. He doesn't leave kids out. You know, he, he gives attention to those who struggle. He gives support to others and it's really important. He's the one to kind of be like, hey guys, let's refocus, let's get back on track, and then pulls them back into the game. We're here to celebrate Austin Cheek today. He has no idea we're here. We're at West Frederick Middle School, and the staff will bring him in shortly. My name is Dr. Dyson. I'm the superintendent of Frederick County Public Schools, and welcome. Like me, you're new to Frederick County Public Schools too, right? You know why you're here? No. <laughs> so we're gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you. You are here because your teacher, Ms. Klein, recommended you for our Impact Award. So Impact Award started a year ago, and it's where we celebrate students for doing amazing things. And I'm sure you know that kindness, and humility and graciousness are all good things that our parents teach us, right? And we try to exercise them here at school. And so we're so proud of you for helping a student who was new to the school. And I, when I read it, I said, oh my goodness, he's new to the school too. And you still found it in your heart to help someone else. What made you do that? That's a good question. Um, it was the right thing to do, I guess. I mean, mm -hmm. it's just the right thing to do. Right, but we thank you for helping him and we have a small gift for you for doing so. Your act of kindness is a great uh, model and example for all the students here and we appreciate you for doing that. So one more time for Austin. <laughs> My mom, she just tells me you should be nice to others because sometimes people dump their like negative energy on you, almost like unfilling a dump truck, but you just have to bounce back and just be nice to people because like they'll be nice towards you and then it'll make the community a better place. People are being nicer to others and it just spreads, it just spreads. Austin is an amazing kid. I had a great time interacting with him and learned a lot from him. I'm so impressed that he is the new kid helping out other new students. He is such a great example of a student leader, and I know why he was nominated to be our Impact Student of the Month. Congratulations, Austin. If you know anyone at your school that is an outstanding student leader, be sure to nominate them by going to our website, www.fcps.org impact. Stay tuned for our next Impact Student of the Month.